XCOM 2. Let's play with Fraka. Now, to catch you guys up, XCOM's goal, its entire reason for existence, is to stop the release of Avatar 2, the blue and the bluer. Now, James Cameron has been pushing this release very strong, very aggressively. But we've been putting up a strong resistance on the XCOM side. A couple of missions ago, we took down James Cameron's facility in Texas. We Michael Bayed that sucker, it became shrapnel. He's gonna have to reshoot those sections of the movie on the way back from Texas. We were attacked by one of James Cameron's aircrafts. Yes, James Cameron has aircrafts. I think he is Skynet. He took down our Avenger, launching a device that was keeping it grounded. And the XCOM units had to had to defend the Avenger. They successfully defended the Avenger, but in doing so, we had a loss. Planet of the Apes won't be coming home. Where are we? I have no idea where, where our Avenger is now. We be... Oh, here it is, okay. So we're gonna go back to making contact in Eastern Europe. Because one thing we do know is James Cameron has another facility in Eastern Europe. He's filming, and we're going to go say hello. Hope he's ready for this. So let's go. You notice we have quite a few things going on. We are low on supplies, as in zero. Okay, look at this. We got two below. He is a new sniper. I want to go assign another person. Due to some of our losses, we have needed to pick up. That's not who we're looking for. We're looking for. Go to the school. Gonna get Big Daddy. And Big Daddy's gonna be a grenader. This guy's not messing around. So we got some guys in training. And we're gonna continue to advance. Okay, we got some new targets. Let's see what we have going on today. We get a scientist on this one. We just have to blow up something to James Cameron's. Not, not too bad. We got, over here we have hack the workstation. We will steal an updated script that could be very useful. And so, so let's see what's in East Asia. We recover an item. I'm not that interested in recovering an item. I do want to go after the script. The idea being Pete Monty, our lead hacker, is currently in good health. So he can go on this he can go on this mission with us and remotely hack that script, giving us saves us about a turn, turn and a half of movement. So here we go. Laughing Sentinel. Call us the Joker, James Cameron. Call us the Joker. Six full squaddies heading out. I'm gonna make utility items available. Alright. Now, one thing to remember is we recently, we recently finished, do we even have, now look at this guys, we have quite a few good looking guys here, but one thing I noticed that we are missing are any rangers, we don't have any sword users up in here. Alright, mustache, you're out. We need... We don't have any sword rangers, period. And you, we have one ranger, and that's Jeeves. Our other rangers have all died. I think I think we know what we're going to do with Pumpkin. Pumpkin's going to become a ranger. As for right now, do we take Flatline? I think so. Let's go in strong. So Mustache's name is Flatline. Do we have any additional items? We Do we have a battle scan? We have a medical kit. So we, we have to think about what we're going to be looking at here as to where we want to put these items. We're going to put the battle scanner on hall monitor because he's going to be our scout. And Gretch is going to carry a medikit. Because Gretch seems to get in the thick of it. And there's our team. Not as diverse as I would like, but it's where we are. We were going in with a large number of sharpshooters. Large number. Alright, interesting team, a focused team, 
hopefully this team will come back. So it's a good thing we have we have Big Daddy in training for becoming a Grenader. We have Pumpkin will queue up as a Ranger. And that'll help return some of that diversity to the team. We probably need at least one more Ranger. The Rangers are in a dangerous position overall simply because they're out in front scouting, looking, searching. And sometimes they take a larger proportion of damage than the rest of the team would. The sharpshooters take less is really how that works out. The hackers and really the grenaders, they move in pretty uh, at a good rate, but really those rangers get in there early and they use that sword to get them right, right into the mix of things. They're a very strong class, but man, they, they do get shot at. So our, van, our, our ship just flew through a building. That's some new tech I didn't even know we had. XCOM units on the ground. Let's go, guys. Okay. Access point. We see a snake. I saw a snake. So we know we have at least one snake up here. Alright. So we're going to get in there. Because James Cameron has been kidnapping humans, putting them in tanks similar to the Avatar situation. And we don't know what he's up to yet. Hopefully we can get some information on that on this mission. Hall Monitor is moving up. I don't see any enemies yet. We do only have eight turns to get in position before, before that computer is shut down. No. Okay, this one provides cover over here. We also have cover up here. Do we have an evac situation? No, we don't. It's not that far. And look, most of this is uncovered. I think let's... We can also put him up here. I think let's put him up here. So, the Sheriff is going to be using Squad Sight. And with Squad Sight, he's going to take some of these long shots. Sheriff is our long shooter. Here's Pete. Pete is our primary hacker. He has done significant numbers on those Terminators. When they drop that Terminator, Pete stuns it, takes it over. It was a critical... Here we go. We have two guys. Stun, a stunner and an officer. Not too bad. I think we can prep up to kill those relatively easy. And we also have quite a bit of room on them. What we got here? We got Gretch. So Gretch is going to get up here in full cover. Pretty close to their sight range, but not terribly close. Flatline. I'm trying to remember what Flatline is. If he's pistols, he's dead eye. What's that? Lightning hand return fire. He got extra grenades. Okay, I think he's pistols. Which means we would like him to be in Overwatch. Put him up here. Alright, flatline mustache. Going to Overwatch. Two below. So two below is he's just a new sniper. Just fresh fresh out of school. And we don't know what he's gonna really want to do, whether he's gonna want to do long or pistols. Right now, Sheriff has been doing a great job as our long shooter. But Tubalo could be a replacement. And Solar. Who's, who's Solar? Oh, it was Hall Monitor. I don't know why they just call him Hall Monitor. Overwatch. Let's see what these guys do. Okay, they're not walking towards us, which is important. Because that's going to allow us to... We have something to hack over here. Okay. So, Gretch. Are they within grenade range for you? Absolutely they are. That's good. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to set up our shots. The sheriff is going to long watch. Pete is going to reposition. Well, I think, I think we take these guys out first. Do we or do we move up? Because if we move him up, he'll be in a much more advantageous. Let's move Hall Monitor up. Hall Monitor a bit more expendable. I hate to say it, it's just true. He's not as high level as Pete. And that's okay. So what we didn't see, which is what we want to verify, is that there's no other enemies up there. Two below. He's got shots on him. We're going to overwatch him. Gretch. Gretch is going to kick it off. That line, similar deal. We're gonna overwatch you. We, we we are setting up for a hard hit on these 
these two these two aliens up here. I'm hoping that we can just drop them immediately. Alright, Gretch. Let them know XCOM's in the house. Gretch pops out. Gretch likes to start the fights. She loves dropping that grenade. Oh! Oh! Boom. Boom. Everything's blowing up. These guys woke up. XCOM's here. Yeah, we're here. Surprise. Officer, you get to cover? I don't know. Overwatch is kicking in. Sheriff's up first. Let's see if he can take that shot. Officer is down. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful ambush by the XCOM team. Gretch kicked us off. Those aliens are down. And Pete still has his move. And we still have quite a few in Overwatch. So we're going to move Pete up here. And we're going to do a battle scan. We know, we know there's a snake somewhere. Scanning protocol. We're going to check this out. See what you can see, Pete. We're checking. Hold the phone. Are those civilians or were those enemies? Down here. Okay, those are civilians. They don't know what's going on. So Pete's scanning protocol is used. We we see we can kind of see a snake up there. Is this some sort of mechanical thing? All right. What we don't want to do is move him too quickly. Hall monitor, you're next up. We're going to leapfrog Pete. And get you in a position. Do you see? He's got something he can hack. Well, I mean, I guess we check it out. Really, Pete's our hacker. He's a higher level. He'll be more successful at it. Hall monitor can can scope this out for us and see if it's worth it. There's a few rewards on hacking that are worth quite a bit of risk. Not necessarily this one. 82% is pretty good for a, a quick a quick cache of alien alloys. How much is that? I don't know. You know what, Hall Monitor? Go ahead and grab that. Hall Monitor, Hall Monitor did fantastic on that hack. Alright, so we have a small cache of alien alloys. Hey, you know what? A little, little bit of extra oomph coming out of this mission. Hall Monitor's is white. Pete's is cooler. Paint your gremlin, Hall Monitor. Sheriff. Sheriff, we're probably going to keep up here. What's that? Kill zone. That's cool. Alright. We're going to move Tubelo up, though. Can Tubelo replace Pete? Does Pete leapfrog? He does have both his... Okay. Pete's going to leapfrog up. Spots anybody? We don't have anyone. We're going to move Pete into Overwatch. Gretch. Does Gretch move up? I think Gretch does. The question is, how far up do we move Gretch? We have Pete in Overwatch. Gretch is going to be aggressive and run up pretty deep. We have spotted some enemies. We got the snake and this crazy looking flight guy. Snake is coming after us. Flight guy triggers Pete's Overwatch. Pete does not get a clean hit. Is he, in this? he is not even covered. We still have lots of guys. Unfortunately, not the greatest shot. Let's see what else we have. Sheriff, you haven't shot yet. 88% chance on this guy. Do we dead eye this guy? Two thirds chance, just about kill him? Or do we just go with this one? Six to eight damage, still leaves us in a good position. Much higher percentage hit. Let's take that one. So take out this James Cameron's Gods of Egypt. Seven damage on the Gods of Egypt. That guy's unhappy. Hey, Pidgeotto. Okay, this guy's... Oh, now... Oh, he has, right. He has Battle Frenzy. He has Battle Frenzy. Not good. But you know what we can do. That is five damage. How much damage do these grenades do? Four to five. Ooh. We have a 50% chance to kill with the sniper rifle. Six to eight. And then we also have one more shooter. We got Mustache. All right, two below. They're big, they're scary, but you're blue. New blue, not Avatar blue. Missed. Two below misses. Two below. I don't know if you're going to be clutch, buddy. Flatline's up. 47% chance on flatline. Let's tell you what, Let's go ahead and take it. Flatline. We need a kill here. Mustache. Show them what you got. Wax up. Wax on. Ooh, mustache with the kill. Some fancy mustaching. 
Okay. Snake is the only enemy we have. It's running. It's running fast. Now, we do have some loot. Gods of Egypt dropped loot. Pete, we want that loot, buddy. We got to get some of that. Get that loot. And then we're going to position you up to hack. So get some loot for us. We got eyes on the target. Ooh, Pete's getting loot. Illyrium core, superior stock. Nice looking loot, guys. And we're going to tuck, tuck him behind here. We, we don't leave you in cover. We don't leave you out of cover. Sheriff. Sheriff has a shot. Sheriff has a long shot on this snake. Ooh, Sheriff. Shoot that rattler. It's back in the old west. Look at that shot. Sheriff doesn't miss, guys. Sheriff doesn't miss. That snake said, I'm running. And Sheriff said, you ain't going nowhere, sugar. What's Gretch going to do? Gretch is going to finish popping off against this snake. Let's go. Let's go, Gretch. You got another boom in your stock. Ooh. Boom, boom, brings all the boys to the yard. And they go. Wow, that's hot. And Pete goes, hey, nice shot. She could teach you, but she'd rather not. All right. So we got hall monitor. We're going to move up. Can we move him up and get the hack? I don't believe so. I think we're going to have to take one more turn. So get up there, Hall Monitor. We don't see any other enemies, but we have not neutralized all enemy targets yet. Two below, we're going to move you up. You have shown yourself not to be the best long shooter. You missed the gods of Egypt. So we're going to keep you a little more in the fray. Mustache. Mustache did solid. We're going to keep you as a flank right now. And Sheriff, you stay on top. Pete's up. Pete, we don't see a way for you to hack right now. So we want to get him to a position where we can hack. Hmm. So the question is, can we just not get in? Do we need an entryway, or does does he not have sight on the computer? I think it's not sight on the computer, so let's get him over here. And still no. Okay. So why don't we make a why don't we make a hole? Pete says, "All right, you know what? Boom! I'm gonna make a hole. Hole made." Sheriff, we're not ready for you. Hall monitor, we are looking for you. We can't get a hack from him either. Alright. So let's move him up here. We really don't know where these other enemies are. We're going to Overwatch. We're going to keep leapfrogging these, this squad. We have found the enemies. It's another god of Egypt and it's a snake. We do have some guys in Overwatch. They spotted Gretch. Gods of Egypt not happy. We have Overwatch kicking in. Hall Monitor taking a shot. Hall Monitor misses. Okay. So, we do have some snipers available. One being my boy, Sheriff. Sheriff doesn't have sight. He can't get the shot. And yeah, he's also out of ammo. So, so two two big misses for Sheriff. Let's get him, move him up. We're not even going to have him reload. We're just going to move him. So that, that God of Egypt and the snake coming after Gretch is a bit concerning. This guy does have some shots. Not good ones, though. Tell you what, Mustache. Not, well. Do we take a shot at, at Gods of Egypt? All right, Mustache. Wax up. It's a low percent hit. You got this mustache him miss it's a miss from from mustache yeah it's still up wonderful two below higher percent chance to hit all right I think we do go for it two below gods of Egypt can you do your thing two blue oh two below also misses gods of Egypt is out in the middle dodging gracefully Gretch still has and we can suppress. I think let's suppress the gods of Egypt. So if he moves, and he's going to want to move. He's moving. Bitch is shooting. Things are happening. Okay. Gods of Egypt moved up. He shouldn't. Blazing pinions. What is this? He is up in the air. Gods of Egypt just launched missiles. Snakes coming up. We do have sight on that computer. Okay, those missiles are coming down. Hall Monitor has been grabbed. 
Snake is sitting on hall monitor. Okay. What happened? Oh, that's the gremlin. Uh, we know, Central. We got a god of Egypt, and he's got a snake pet, and we got to handle these first. First things first. I don't know. These look like trouble to me. I'm going to move Pete first. Actually, we need to move Gretch first. Here's the plan. We're going to move Gretch and Pete out of this blast zone. Hopefully, Gretch can get a shot on this snake. Freeing Hall Monitor. Pete's going to move up and hack. And I'm going to depend on the sharpshooters, the snipers, to take out the rest of the snake and the god of Egypt. So moving up. So which one gives us flank? I think this one gives us a flank. We are on Gretch. Yeah. We have to move her. We don't want to take a shot at the gods of Egypt without moving her out of this blast radius. Okay. First things first, let go a hall monitor. So Gretch, use that minigun. Free out that snake. Just straight killed it. Snake is down. Hall monitor gets up. Yeah. Gods of Egypt's up there. Gretch with a big promotion. Pete's up next. We want Pete to get clear. We also want him to be able to hack the system. So we're going to move him right over here. Alright, Pete, you're our hacker. We're going to get get that updated plan from James Cameron. This is the project plan. This is who, who are they looking to market to, where they're looking to market. He's got it. Let's see. Ooh! Whoa! Hold the phone, guys! This soldier's hacking stat permanently increased by 20 and almost 100% chance. Pete, don't fail this now, man. Well, it was a close roll, but it really didn't fail. Pete gets 20 hack. He's my primary hacker. If you guys haven't seen Hackers the Movie, it's about Pete and Angelina Jolie. You're doing good, Pete. All right, he's got camo gremlin. Pete hacks, got the script. A major increase on his hacking skill. All right, oh, what do you mean you can't see this guy? Oh, he can't shoot because he needs to reload. Okay. Reload your weapon. And you got a pistol. Oh, watch that pistol. Flat line. Somewhat of a shot on Gods of Egypt. Let's take out the God of Egypt. Can you bring him down a level? Or eight. Dimitri, mustache, taking a shot. Eight damage in the sky. That's right, Gods of Egypt. That's right. A frenzy? Doesn't matter. Two below. Also a shot. Teach him a lesson, two below. Will this be your initial kill, Gods of Egypt? Here we go. Oh, Gods of Egypt is down. Dropped him in the middle of his own blast radius. That's it, guys. That's it. A pretty successful mission. A little bit of damage on one soldier. Hall who got a little wrapped up with the snake lady, the siren. Gods of Egypt, a couple of them. Launched some attacks took out some gods. Swift, fast mission for the XCOM units. James Cameron, we got your plan. All my guys are going home. Sheriff, lots of good shots. Gretch shooting everything, blowing things up. Hall monitor under some fire. Pete got in there quick, got the hack done. Critical player opened up the wall himself. Gretch used up her grenades. And two below, not a bad rookie showing. Not a great rookie showing, but not a bad rookie showing. He's first out. He's got some nice looking blue armor. Hopefully, hopefully he'll do a little better. His long shooting, I have some concerns on. Initially, I was hoping that he could be our new long shooter. I'm still, I have some concerns on it. Maybe he's better with pistols. You know? Some guys just like two pistols. Some guys like one big shot, one big gun. Some guys like a couple little pistols. Two below, that's two pistols. Gretch, big promotion. Tubalo did not get a promotion. He did get a kill, but he did not get a promotion. So let's see what Gretch gets. Gretch has two options. Heavy ordnance. Ooh. She gets an extra grenade. Hollow targeting. So, and, and you kind of, it sounds like it's Rook's similar to the mark from the officer, where she can pick out some guy and mark it. Gretch burns through those, those grenades every turn. I think we're going to get her heavy ordnance because the more things we blow up, the more boom boom she brings. And everybody knows Gretch got the boom boom. Alright. And that's the squad. We got quite a bit of loot. 
Illyrium core. We need quite a few more cores. Critical pickup by Pete. We got some corpses. We have two Archon corpses. Look at this. Gods of Egypt came home with us. And we got those alien alloys that Hall Monitor got for doing that initial hack. So a very successful mission. Yeah, we can research that. We will get to it. So very, very strong play. And we got a, a new soldier. Daniel. Daniel Trouble. Very interesting. So, all right. That's exciting. Wait, where do we get this guy? I'm going to check out this guy. We got Detox with some promotion, and he's a ranger. This worked out perfectly for us, guys. So Detox, our ranger, we just picked him up. He says, I want to self-recruit. So Detox is in. We're going to promote him. And I tell you what, we need, do, do we want a phantom? Planet of the Apes was another phantom. I, I got to say, though, comparatively to Nico and Planet of the Apes, Jeeves has been a critical member of the team. M little, runs that edge between safety and danger, but I think I think that's what we have to do. So detox. I think you're gonna be a blade master, man. Yeah, not a scout, a blade master. Yes. So he is going. Oh, look at look at this. Do we have another upgrade with this guy? This guy's coming in, coming in ready to roll. Detox is going to be up on missions immediately. Shadow Step, man. It's a no-brainer. And another one. We're going to get you running gun, bud. Or conceal. No, running gun. This guy just runs. He just guns. Detox. <laughs> Look at me. He came in. We need a ranger. Detox says, I'm a ranger. Heard you need a ranger. Done deal. New soldier. Detox. Big win. XCOM. Tides. Tides were looking bad for a second there. We had a mission go pear shape, but last few missions very successful. We just have guys walking on the base, heavy hitter guys. Exciting mission for XCOM. You guys have a good good afternoon.